everyone, Joel Ants here. Today I am in San Jose, yes, San Jose, California, outside. Chicken meats rice, chicken meats rice, guys. Here doing a Hyannese chicken and rice challenge. Yes, so you guys like the different cuisines. I'm super excited to hear to try this out. So it's just, essentially, this is an absolutely giant chicken, rice, and or greens plate. Um, so you, the standard, they have like the Hainan chicken, Hainan chicken, which is like a poached chicken. They have grilled, they have fried. We are gonna have all of that. The whole plate is supposed to weigh about eight pounds, really, really big. Um, we have 30 minutes to complete the challenge in order to get the meal for free. And if not, I think we're sitting around 70 bucks. So I'll get you the exact details though. So let's head on in, let's have some fun. Um, we'll eat some food. And like I said, there's all kinds of flavors and stuff. So I'm just gonna use some info. Let's head on in, let's go eat. Everyone, so here with all the food looks super, super Super delicious. So I have the Hainan chicken. So this is like a poached chicken. It is literally soft as butter. Like I am so excited to try that. That's kind of really, you know, the star, one of the stars, I should say. We then have their fried chicken, which looks super awesome and crispy. Kind of looks like a katsu in a way, but guys, this smells so good and I'm pumped. They're grilled chicken. We got lemongrass, we got turmeric, all kinds of different seasonings. Super crispy looking, delicious grilled skin on that then have their signature. Now these things, they sell out of every single day. These are their chicken skins, fried chicken skins. Apparently these are like just the go-to when you're here, you gotta give them a shot. Then have um, some of the greens. I have their pickled carrots. These are a signature thing called dishes. We then have their cucumbers. We then have the cilantro, all again, very kind of standard toppings are coming with it. We then have the Hyannese rice, which is made with their own chicken stock. They have garlic, whole kinds of other flavors in there. So yeah, this looks super, super awesome. And guys, I've never had kind of this style of cuisine before, but I am pumped. And I do have all of their sauces. There's like seven, six or seven different sauces here. Um, and they all kind of are paired and different kind of Asian inspired. So what do we have, what's this one? That's a Thai ginger soy from the Thailand region. Thai ginger soy from Thailand, I like it. Now this is the Chinese one? Yeah, ginger scallion oil. Ginger scallion oil. I mean, I'm pumped to try all of these. Then this is the spicy one? Yeah, Singapore chili. Singapore chili, I do like a little bit of heat. It looks, it's a, it's a nice color. I don't know, we're gonna try that. Um, sweet chili Thai, yes. that's, pretty, that's pretty standard, but nonetheless, probably really good with that fried chicken. This one right here? Teriyaki. Teriyaki, Japanese? Yes. Japanese, and hey, who doesn't like some teriyaki? And this last one? A savory ginger from the Vietnam region. Savory ginger from Vietnam region. So I'm sure it's quite savory, I'm sure it's gingery. So at that, let's get started here, guys. We're gonna have 30 minutes to complete this challenge, like we said, um, but that's about it. So yeah, Hanny's food, Hanny's cuisine, you always like to see these different kinds of foods. So let's get a rockin', rollin'. Let's start here just momentarily. So uh, yeah, anyway, do some cutlery. I'm definitely gonna dive in my hands. I'm gonna crank up some of these sauces though, give them a shot. So this is like their signature one. Oh man. Guys, <laughs> this is damn good. This is the, the one, the signature one. The Thai ginger soy, yes. Thai ginger soy. I'm just gonna. Yeah, yeah. Guys, that is so, so, so good. And uh, I also have some just chicken broth there. They gave me some chicken broth, I wanna drink that. Anyway, that is like, wow. Okay, anyway, I'm invested now. All right, so how about we get started? Let's say the count of five, four, three, two, one. Let us eat. Guys, that chicken with that Thai ginger soy. Mm. It's like a spark of flavor in my mouth. Woo! I got some greens as well. Gotta like stay healthy. I'll probably mix all these flavors, but. Mm. Jeez. Okay. Mm. Mm. I'm gonna some more of that. What else goes good on this, this, this one? Um... The ginger scallion oil, mm. the green one. Mm. And the chicken is so soft. Woo! I think it's even better than sous vide, guys. It's cooked perfectly, tender, but still has texture. Mm. Oh, wow. Fresh ginger in that one. Mm. That is pungent. 
Hey everyone, welcome to this video. Today we are here at Chicken Meats Rice in Santa Clara, California, taking on their absolutely giant chicken and rice challenge. So here we have all their different kinds of meats. We have the Hainan chicken, the Hainese chicken, which is an amazingly soft, tender, awesome, like cooked chicken. It went so well with all the different sauces. We then had the grilled chicken, which looked absolutely fantastic. And then we had the fried chicken, which looked a lot like a katsu as well. And again, you guys don't have to be like super quiet. Or <laughs> I'm gonna try some of this little spicy one. You said be careful, so let's see how hot it is. Very interesting flavor. It's not that hot though. Good chili though. I like it. So, let's try a chicken skin. All right. That is, I tell you what, it's like a potato chip, but a chicken potato chip. Chicken potato chip. I like it. Healthy veggies. Yeah. Super impressed with the, how soft that handy's chicken was off. So as I mentioned, we had 30 minutes to complete the challenge, and man, we had like so many cool additions on here. What I really liked is that these plates normally, like you can get vegetables, they come with vegetables. So I had some pickled carrots, I had little cucumbers, I had cilantro, and just having all those greens, the, the freshness and stuff, like this is the perfect grab-and-go food. And there's a couple locations in the area I would definitely be eating here on a regular if I was, well, if I was a local. How does the cilantro usually mix in? How's the cilantro? How's it usually mixed in just like with everything? Yeah, it just sits right on top of the carrots, yeah. Mmm. Mm. Wow. <laughs> that rice, wow. Alright. That was an amazing bite. Carrot cilantro on this rice? Me and rice are usually like. Wow. Hot damn. Delicious. Maybe my favorite tasting rice ever. How are we doing for time? How far are we in? Four minutes, 20 seconds in. I've kind of just lost, just track, I got distracted, I'll give it everything was. Let's try this grilled chicken. Mmm. Mm -mm. Those grilled flavors. Definitely coming through. Good crisp on that skin. Mmm. We'll find out. Yeah. Ooh, chicken broth. That's good. The sweet chili. This one? Yeah, sweet chili. What was, what was that one again? That was amazing. It's the savory ginger. Peanut. Savory ginger. How do you run? Sweet chili attack. Very sweet. They had so many different sauces, so you could have, re have really endless flavor combinations. And like seriously, having the bites of the chicken with the bites of the rice, the bites of the sauce, the bites of the vegetables, it all just went so well together. You can tell that they really kind of like engineered the flavors to go well with each other. And I gotta say, even though I wasn't, you know, even able to try everything yet in this challenge, it was so good. The sauces were savory, some of them were really rich, you know, so some had a little bit of spice and heat. It was just so enjoyable. And for somebody who loves flavors like myself, this was just awesome. We also had their uh, special chicken, uh, deep fried chicken skins. Those things sell out. 
super cool item. I've never seen anybody basically making chicharrones out of chicken skins. And uh, like just pretty much that's kind of that, you know. Um, I believe the meal was about $70 uh, if we were not to finish. However, if we did complete it, we were going to get the free meal and a sweet t-shirt. Um, so overall though, I think that's like the majority of the information. Let me know down below if you prefer grilled chicken, fried chicken, or more kind of like a traditional, we'll call it baked or roasted, broiled, roasted, whatever you want to call it, chicken. Um, I gotta say though, I absolutely loved all of these bites and you know to have a restaurant you know actually be like yes the grilled chicken is awesome is so rare to find most places try to like hide their grilled chicken but man they had the grilled chicken good they had all the chickens oh so good so like I said we'll tune on in hopefully I get to try the fried chicken as well and uh, like I said let me know if you prefer grilled chicken fried chicken or baked chicken down below and ultimately at that let's see if we can complete this challenge and let's get going it's good that's my favorite thing One thing I'll also mention is the quality of this chicken is super, super impressive. It's cooked perfectly. It's moist and juicy. Thank you so much. And they have a, um, a Mary's chicken, I believe it's called, which is an absolute top of the line, like no GMO, no whatever. They sell it in Whole Foods. Whole Foods sells exclusively. So they really, really, really have like put the quality ahead. And you can taste the difference. Just like, so moist. Perfectly soft, tender. And I believe we're just over nine minutes in, or nine-ish. Right, with fried chicken. Oh, thank you, got some more sauces. The rice, chicken skins. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> compliments to the chef, compliments to the chef. Really good. I love these, the way the pickles and the cilantro. Pickled carrots are this. Mix this. Ooh. Chicken broth. We got real passion for the chicken broth over on this side of the room. But I will say, that is a nice way to kind of bring that down. I'm gonna save the rest of those for the rice. Guys, fried chicken, hunko, breading. Woo! Mmm. Through that crunch. That's some 3D crunch. Wow. Yeah, this is good. This, uh, which one? Thai ginger soy. Thai ginger soy. I know this would go good with everything. Well, I'll just put it on everything. Mmm. It's like the Frank's hot sauce. I put that on everything. Hot dang. Mm. God, too good. Mmm. Those flavors. How do you get the chicken so perfectly crispy? Secret. <laughs> like, 
That is crazy. It's so like crispy, but it's fine and crispy. Alrighty, guys, very, very good, very good chicken, and I can't believe how crispy that was, it was just so impressive, so, now I got some skins, got some rice, some of the uh, vegetables left, and that's about that, but man, that is, uh, <coughs> ooh, inhaled it. Delicious. Ugh. Eat the food. Don't inhale it. Wrong way. Alright. Chicken skins. It also reminds me like a chicharron. I just want to call it chicken chicharron. Chicken runs, chicken runs. Chicken runs. Chicken runs. All right, that was great. Actually, that chicken run though. Skim, it's a really nice savory feel. That probably would have been really good with some of the bites of the Hades chicken. High nut chicken. All right, woo! Those veggies, guys, and this rice. I'll be civilized, I'll use a spoon. Mmm. And that sauce, that is a good call. Hot damn. You guys sell that stuff? You should. <laughs> Buy it by the gallon, guys. Done the last place. Very possibly the best tasting rice slash rice combo with the sauce and everything I've ever had. There we go. <laughs> What was the time there, my friend? 18 12? Cool. So somewhere just over 18 minutes, everybody. I gotta say, that was honestly exceptional. I did not know what to expect. I was going into this like kind of blind, getting ready to Haney's chicken, Haney's kind of food. That chicken rice is just like a tr very traditional kind of item. The array of sauces and different flavors I had. I basically got to tour a lot of different Asian cultures with each bite. But I gotta say, this Haney's chicken, the Hainan chicken, super soft, definitely nice and juicy. This, excuse me, comments to the chef. This grilled chicken, I gotta say, not often is grilled chicken like a really like highlight of a store. Often I think a lot of restaurants try to put it on the back burner. This grilled chicken, do not sleep on it. That was delicious. Perfectly cooked, moist, great like flavors on it. 
and it was lightly flavored as well. You can grab any of your favorite sauces and deck it out with that. I gotta say this fried chicken as well, super, super impressive. I think it may have actually even been my favorite, but between the grilled chicken, <coughs> between the grilled chicken and the fried chicken, it was such a close like call. Um, but I gotta say, both were really, really, really good. The favorite, my favorite sauce today was the chili sauce and the one that goes on everything, ginger. Thai ginger soy. Thai ginger soy. So I definitely recommend both of those. Mix them up a little bit. That's my rec. <coughs> Man, I keep inhaling part of the rice in my mouth. <clears throat> definitely would recommend trying that out. Uh, but that one, a huge thank you to Chicken Meats Rice guys. I gotta say, this was absolutely awesome. I um, really, really enjoyed it. And the chicarones, chicarones were also really good. Um, so for that, like I said, I want to give a huge thanks to all the staff. Thank you, everybody who came on out. Really appreciate that. <laughs> Definitely a delicious, delicious challenge. Um, now, while I wouldn't say stop on by, Definitely get yourself a normal size portion. You don't need one this big, I'll put it that way. But I liked it, it was great. Kind of a really nice, kind of healthy on the go edition as well. They got three and I believe soon to be four, about four locations in the area. And I would definitely recommend stopping up. Uh, if you do, say, hey, I saw that guy eat way too much food. Maybe they'll have a laugh. Maybe they'll give you some. I don't know, I'll leave that to them. I'll leave that to them. Maybe they'll give you some of these freaking chicken skins, which they literally sell out every day so they like sometimes even ration them every other day which is crazy to think about so that's about it guys i got nothing else to say about we can meal fruit which is cool we get a sweet t-shirt which is a chicken meats rice shirt i'll show you that as well and uh that's about that so of course so everybody until next time say happy the hungry happy eating san jose here we are and at that have a lovely day Alrighty. Alrighty, so let's actually get started. Um, does somebody want to be our official timer for today? No? Yes? Right somebody? Yeah. Alright, we got our official timer. Um, I always love throwing, like, you know, just people come by and I'm like, will you help me? And they're like, uh, I'm like, yeah, okay. I'll take that as a yes. 